Thank you. Thank you.
an awesome God. He's a holy God. He's a righteous God. He is a great God. There is none that can compare to his majesty or his grace. What a mighty God we serve. And we've come once more again. Again, we call you God, and again you answer. Again, we reach out, God, and again you pull us to you, God. One more time, God, you've allowed us to come into your presence. We don't take it for granted this morning, God, that we're in the presence of a mighty and great God, a holy God, a holy God. Oh, God, we love you so much on this morning. We appreciate you this morning. We thank you for this opportunity to be in your presence one more time, God. Because in your presence is everything we need, God. In your presence, God, is everything we need this morning, God. If somebody came in here on spiritual life support, God, they're in the right place, God, because they're in your presence. In your presence this morning is healing, God. In your presence this morning there's deliverance, God. In your presence this morning is answers, God. In your presence, God, is healing. Mm. There's life in your presence, God. We not come to tell you what to do. This is your moment. This is your moment, God. You've got a plan. Use it for your glory, God. Use it, God. And it's not contained to these walls, God. You're going beyond this wall, going to the airways, God. Somebody needs you. Somebody across this country is looking to you, God, to touch them on this morning, God. Somebody has hope that they need you, God, to restore, God. God, in your presence this morning is somebody's peace of mind, God. Oh, God, we thank because we serve a great and holy God, a righteous God, a powerful God. Mm, God is in your presence this morning. God, you've been good to us, God. You've been better than good to us, God. You keep on proving over and over again that if we just show up and look to the hills, I was come with our help, God, and trust you, God. You've got a plan. And so we're trusting your plan. Now, God, we have one request this morning, God. God, before our pastor speaks one word, before he ministers one word, God, God, I'm asking you not to let him have to serve out of his reserve. Out of, oh, God, hallelujah. Mm, God, oh, God, I'm asking you to pour into him, God. 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 Oh, God, let it be overflow that he ministered some from this morning, God. Let him minister from his excess, God. Give him more than enough, God. Oh, God, restore all to him. Let the reservoir within him flow, God. Oh, God, I'm trusting you now. I know he's studied. I know he's prepared. I know he's been here. That's his yes, God. That's the nature of his yes, God. So I don't have to ask you to give him a word. I simply ask that you give him. Ah, my she got him. She got him. She got him. Give him, God, what you know he deserves and what he earns, God. God, I'm asking you to touch every life you want today, God. God, breathe, 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 God, breathe, God. Your breath of life is more than enough, God. Breathe the Lord in this atmosphere, God, and speak a word, God. Speak life, speak life. Most of all, be God, be God, be God, be God, be God, be God. Be God, and we trust you to do just that. In the matchless name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, put your hands together and thank Him in advance for what He is about to do.
to us, hallelujah. And we just come to bless him for all that he's done for us. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it, love it.
for keeping me beautiful. For all of my over the airway listeners, let me apologize to you for not giving you time to get your bread and your wine together. Or to hear it being blessed. We're going to perfect it so that my cyber members will be also able to take you in with us. Of course, this is for Sunday, so I'd like you to come and share in the Holy Communion service. Praise the Lord, you can come to the facility and not tell you anyone that you cannot come to church. I just feel like those who really want to come will come, and they'll just be in place since we're all having service and we're moving forward. And if somebody's waiting for an invitation to come to say we're formally open, uh, I don't feel led to make that announcement as of yet, but the whole thing that I've done so this is that you desire to be in the presence of the Lord, then you're certainly welcome to do so. This is the house where God reveals His glory. And if you want the glory to impact your life, you got to come to the house. And that way, where all the safety measures are in place, and we just want to deal with things accordingly. And as the dealing with governmental regulations and policies, but communion is communion. And I certainly know that we need to do something a little bit different so that I can be inclusive of all those who want to share and take it. Now, it is extremely important because he has told us as often as you do this, you do show forth the Lord's death until he comes. And so we need to do it. We can do it every day and it still would not be sufficient to recognize that God died for my sins and that I owe him everything. Thank you for all of you. Praise the Lord, bless your way to, to do come. Thank God for Jesus. Uh, one of the things that I've been cited is the fact that uh, it is now uh, my announcements for that day. Okay. Now, you can leave it right there, Kenny. Because I'm going to have the deacons to come in just a few minutes. I know the, the saints want to deal with the giving. I'm thankful unto God for all of you who consistently pledge the lot, pass 